Hey everybody, today we are talking about Pipio. This is an AI avatar text-to-speech software, and the reason we're talking about it is because it is now on AppSumo. They have lifetime deals. We'll scroll down really quick, give you a sneak peek before we go over it. Lifetime deals for this program to where you can create uh, realistic AI avatars that will talk for you. So you don't have to record any videos. You don't have to hire another actor because you don't want to be on video. You don't even have to talk. You don't have to have someone else talk. It's all AI. It's all computer generated and it's pretty darn good. And this is the dashboard. We're going to go over it in a second. I signed up for a trial. The trial is over, but I can still log into the back. Let's go over the plans and features. These are lifetime access, so you'll never have to pay a monthly fee. It's basically matching all of the premium stuff. So let's jump over the pricing. So everything on this plan here, it's going to be tagged to for the AppSumo. So even if you get the tier three, you're still tied to the premium and not the enterprise. So whatever they add to the premium, will AppSumo creators will get as well. Basically, you're getting 54 digital actors, and this is just currently, they're gonna be adding to it. Uh, on their roadmap, they've already got this scheduled to, to add plenty more. 650 plus digital voices, 62 premium text-to-speech voices, and I, I do believe these are well-said voices, which well-said is fantastic voice quality uh, for AI. But I'll show you the differences in the back end, a well-said voice to a regular digital voice. There is a difference in quality, but it's not massive. Like if you didn't know playing them one after another, you probably wouldn't tell a huge difference between the two as far as quality goes. But if you're really paying attention to it, you will. Currently, 140 plus unique languages. Now they do only export in 1080p HD resolution, but they do have 4K on the horizon. It is literally in the roadmap, and we're gonna go over that here in a second as well. Uh, voice file upload. So you can upload your own voice. So if you don't want to use the AI voice, you don't have to. You can upload your own voice and have one of their custom avatars talk it for you, essentially. And it'll match their lip movement to your voice. So that's the features, pretty cool. So let's go over tiers and pricing. Here's where it starts. License tier one, 15 credits. Each credit is essentially one minute of video. Unlimited downloads, so you, you create a video and you can download as many times as you want. 15 credits, per month for tier one, 60 credits per month for tier two, 120 credits per month for tier three. So let's go over and check their pricing on their website. This is the only thing they offer right now is premium. It's in beta. They just launched for the public uh, not too long ago. So they're still very new. $20 a month for 25 credits per month. And this is paid yearly. So if you're doing monthly, it's 25. A dollar per minute. And you're getting 15 every month forever just on the tier one. Tier two is actually twice as good as their current plan on their website for 169 bucks and you don't have to ever pay anything again. Currently, there is no enterprise version, unfortunately for me. That's definitely the one I would want. And that is actually the reason that I haven't purchased one yet because I, I can't decide which one of the tiers I want. Tier one is a fantastic deal and I'll at the very least get that one. I want enterprise though, so I may end up upgrading in the future to that, so if that's the case, I'm not sure if I want to buy the tier three, but at the same time, I may never use two hours per month. That's quite a bit, it's quite a bit. And this is export time. It's not like most AI software where you pay for, to kind of preview it. You only pay for the finalized video. You can mess around with it forever and not, not ever use any of your credits. So you spend 30 minutes playing, adjusting, previewing, and then you just export a three minute finalized video ready to post. You only pay three credits. So it's a very good system. It's, but that being said, I can't decide between the two because I may need more in the future. I just don't know. Might end up going with tier one and just upgrading to enterprise as I need it. Cause there's a very good chance I'm not gonna use it at all for the next year. Cause I don't have anything in the plans to use it. Another big thing you get with AppSumo, the lifetime deal. And the reason I'm definitely buying one of them is the extra credits. So the credits are five for five bucks or basically a dollar per extra minute. So even if you go over your limit, all you gotta do is pay an extra dollar for however many minutes you want. Compare it to their prices, that's gonna save you money too right here. That alone might actually be worth paying for at the very least the $50 one. The custom avatar for $250 instead of 1,000. So what is a custom avatar you say? Right? I'm glad you asked. <laughs> so a custom avatar is you. You can make an avatar of yourself. 
and the AI version. So you can still be in these videos, but never actually have to sit down and record them outside the first 15 minutes. And this is a huge discount because it's normally $1,000. So every AppSumo member, it's 250 bucks each and you can have more than one. And I'm not sure there's even a limit. So you can have your whole team, have, it, have an avatar of your whole team if you have a, a team of creators. That's pretty cool. 250 bucks a piece. What shots are available for custom avatars? We have mid torso up and mid waist up. Now I'm gonna jump in real quick and show you exactly what they mean by that. So this one is the shoulders up and then this one is the torso and up. So those are your two different options for your custom avatar. Uh, it does take five to seven business days to create your avatar, which kind of contradicts itself, 48 to 72 hours. So this is the actual train time. Obviously it does say that to actually do the full thing. I'm assuming they give themselves some leeway here. Only you can access your avatar and that is exactly how it should be. Will my avatar have my voice? This is the disappointing part. It will not have your voice. They do have a request for this in their roadmap and I, I truly, truly hope that they add this because I really want a custom avatar with my voice. I, I just think that's so cool. And that's one of the biggest selling factors for me, personally. If you want more information on this though, you can go to mypipio.com slash performance guidance. And this link is going to be posted down below. So don't worry, all the links are gonna be posted down below. So just go down there, click it. You don't have to worry about typing it in. So this is your dashboard. When you log in, this is what you want to, this is what you'll see, except you won't see the projects here. So you click create a project, select your avatar from all the options they have. And most of them have the shoulder and the torso, the full torso. And then they'll have different clothing options. Like just get a pink shirt and then a yellow shirt here. So there's multiple of the same ones. Um, but they got tons of them. You can do a preview of them. This is a preview of what your actor and final video will look like. Click the voice. So it looks very realistic. Do this one. This is a preview of what your actor and final video will look like. Click the voices icon in the left nav bar to preview and select different voices, languages, and speaking styles to pair with your actor. Now you can't tell me that isn't insanely good. So you just pick your avatar, you go over to voices. Uh, right now it's Gia V, English US. We don't we we don't want that one. We want this Isabel. is a preview of what your actor's voice will sound like. Type or paste your script to get started. This one's very quiet. Let's try Joey. This is a preview of what your actor's voice will sound like. Type or paste your script to get started. There's two Jodies. One's narration, one's promotional. This is a preview of what your actor's voice will sound like. Type or paste your script to get started. Do you hear the difference? Pretty cool. So let's add voice. Oh, and another thing up here with voices, you can actually sort them. You can sort them by language. They have tons of different languages. You can sort them by male or female. I don't know why they're doing she, her, just put male or female. I don't know why we're complicating things. Um, style, narration, conversation, promotional, stuff like that. So, I mean, you got a lot of options here. The big W here, the green one, that just means it's a well-said premium voice. Uh, generally speaking, they are the better ones. Uh, let's do a quick test. Let's go down. Here's Nicole. This is a preview of what your actor's voice will sound like. All right, we're gonna scroll down. Let's do uh, Elizabeth. This is a preview of what your actor's voice will sound like. Type or paste your script to get started. See, there is a quality difference, but it's not like huge. It's not massive. This is a preview of what your actor's voice will sound like. Type or paste your script to get started. There's one. Oh, actually, let's do one that's not English. Let's do English. Here's Arabic. Let's try Croatian. Ovo je pregled kako će zvučati glas vašeg glumca. Upišite ili zalijepite svoju skriptu da biste započeli. Pretty fun to mess with too. Uh, you can change the back end, you can do the back end, <laughs> the background, you can do any colors you want. Very easy to change, just immediately. Boom, bright, dark, whatever, whatever you want. Or you can do a picture, that looks terrible. Yeah, it looks like she's in the office, in front of the person. <laughs> and then, or you could 
uh, search form, say office. Okay, all of them are offices. Let's do park. All right, it'll load in, say park scenes, boom. Now she looks like a reporter, so that's kind of cool. Most of them don't really fit, but it's no different than like putting a screen back when you have a green screen you're talking, it's kind of similar to that. Uh, now text, generally, you would be able to put text. Currently, there's a bug, see? Due to technical difficulties we're currently experiencing with the text feature, adding text to your video export may produce unintended results. Uh, basically, when you do this, you export, you get a black screen back is what happens. We recommend uploading and adding your text as an image until this issue has been resolved. Please direct any questions to support at mypipio.com. But generally speaking, it's they got a lot of options on uh, customizing the text. Uh, so when they get this fixed, it'll be pretty cool. So for now, we'll delete that. <clears throat> and they got elements. You can do shapes, all kinds of different stuff. Uh, you can do images, different videos if you want that to play a video. Um, and then you can upload your own images, videos, music. Uh, but after that, you just kind of type in your script, play script to make sure it sounds good. When we create your synthetic avatar, our team must be able to remove you from the footage. So a green screen or solid background is required for filming. Or you can just upload your own audio. Now, I would give you an example of that, but I don't have one made yet. I'll probably do that on the review, which is coming soon. To add a clip, you just clip right there, and then say this one's done. Let's start the other script. Script, the other, <laughs> the other clip. And that's where this guy comes in. He's going to be talking. Uh, we want a solid background of, let's go light blue. Don't want to say anything. And we'll just have him repeat the same old thing. Oh, let's change his voice. Let's do Michael. Add voice. Play script. When we create your synthetic avatar, our team must be able to remove you from the footage. So green screen or solid background is required for filming. So we're done with this one. We add another clip. And each one, each clip can have a thousand characters, which comes up to about a minute of video. And you can have three clips on the trial, so three minutes per video on the trial, uh, when you sign up for either the lifetime deal or their regular deal. It's five clips, so five minutes is your maximum video, which sounds really limiting, but you can always export multiple videos and clip them together in a separate video editor. It's kind of annoying, but not necessarily you know, a make it or break it type thing. And they do plan on upgrading this in the future. I've heard it's gonna be upgraded to 10. Uh, I don't know if they're gonna go past that. And I would assume we're going to be grandfathered in since we're supposed to be tied to their current premium plan. So as long as it's added to their premium plan, we should be good. And that's basically the dashboard. So you'd wanna click up here to preview it. Unfortunately, I am on a subscription, or I'm not on a subscription yet. I was just on a trial, which has been expired for a couple days now. So I can't preview anymore. Uh, it is in beta, so it only kind of worked on and off anyways. Uh, and then when you wanted to make the video, you just click export, which again, I can't do yet. We're saving that for the review video, which should be, I'm hoping in a couple days. Now let's go check out the roadmap. It's at mypipio.com slash pipio roadmap. Again, this is gonna be in the description down below. So just go click that link, keep it easy. Uh, this is for feature requests right here. Make a feature request, put in your name, email, hit add idea. And here's the current roadmap. In progress. So they're working on currently more user-friendly speech editing. This is required. This, this is actually one of the complaints they've been getting on their reviews and in the questions a lot. So this is definitely something they're working on now. Avatar facial expressions and gesture control. This one's going to be so cool. I can't wait till that one comes out. Uh, additional avatars, this is probably something that's always going to be on this side. I highly doubt they're ever going to stop adding avatars, considering that's their main focus. And then here's what they got planned over here. New digital actors, 
uh, full body avatars. Now this sounds really cool, full body avatars, but in reality, it's not something anyone's gonna use a whole lot because when was the last time you've seen a full body person in a video? Like, it's just not very common. Avatar appearance customizations. I think they mean by like clothes on this one. Here, let me jump back. I think it'll, yep, hair, makeup, clothing. Okay, additional text-to-speech voices. They have quite a bit now, but I think they're always pretty much looking for partner, partner companies to add to their library. One of the things people seem to be worried about is if they get, if well said drops the, the contract with them. Uh, head pose and motion control. Additional video sizes. Now I have heard multiple times that this is already being worked on and the only reason it's not out is because of the bugs. But they are planning on adding the long form for like uh, shorts and TikToks and stuff. And then the one by ones for like Instagram and like Facebook posts. Preview video before exporting. But yeah, this one should probably be in progress over here. Preview video before exporting. This one's also in beta. That's what I was talking about. It works sometimes, not always. So that one honestly should be in progress as well. 4K video export. Uh, this one's huge, so I can't wait till I get that one out. I'm not 100% sure if this one's gonna be on the premium plan though. It could be something that's only on Enterprise. I can definitely see that happening. The video templates, they don't have any video templates right now. Um, and that has been requested quite a bit in the, and asked about quite a bit in the questions. Avatar API, I don't even understand how this would work, but I'm not necessarily a developer. I know more than most people, but not enough to explain how that would be used. Because generally APIs are just information requests for apps and stuff, so I don't, I don't know. Lack of knowledge in that area. Uh, create your own text to speech. These, these are the ones that could be possible here soon, but they haven't decided on. Create your own text to speech voice. This one is huge for me. I would love to have my own custom avatar with my own voice. I love that. Just the idea of that. I don't, I don't know why. I like it. <laughs> I don't even know if I'd ever use it, but like. create your own avatar process built into the web application. Uh, this is for custom avatars, uh, so that you can just upload it right into their app instead of going and yeah, doing a Dropbox or Google Drive. Uh, that's what they got on their roadmap, and it's looking pretty promising, looking, looking pretty cool. So that is Pipio, the AI avatar software. It's pretty cool, and it's on AppSumo. I don't know how long it's going to last. Generally, deals like this last a month or two sometimes longer get it while you can it's super cheap the 49 dollar price buy-in is very very good price uh, for what you're getting and that'll lock in all the coupons as well i'll see you on the next video uh the next one's gonna be a review on this puppy they get that bug fixed and i get it out very soon uh, i'll talk to y'all later